Good afternoon. It is Friday, July 17th. Skipped yesterday. The big thing that I accomplished was starting some work in the kitchen. Um, basically moving things so that the box for the TV is behind that table instead of out here in front of stuff. I've not really moved or gone through anything or reorganized much. I've just gotten that out of the way because at some point my goal was to reorganize some stuff here in the kitchen and getting that out of the way seemed like step one. Uh, but otherwise, uh, you know, just, yeah, well, one thing, this is the last day of my weird schedule, getting off at 5.30. Next week, go back to normal. Wonderful. Um, although I have gotten things accomplished, you know, I, I read the Mythic Odysseys of Theros, and then the last couple, you know, today and yesterday, uh, in the morning, uh, I used the time to edit vlogs and unboxings, Enough that I have quite a few ready and up and good to go. Like, like I'm, I'm at a good, as far as things that I'd already recorded, almost all of it, uh, with the exception of a couple of the current campaign's sessions um, I, I, that I haven't edited, but everything else I've already edited. But pretty much yesterday was, you know, just, you know, hanging out, staying home. Today's going to be hanging out, staying home. So is the weekend. Uh, Austin tested positive for COVID. Uh, he's fine. Seems fine. Doing all right. Um, and he's pretty sure that he would have come in contact with it the Friday following the last Monday that we gamed. But that doesn't mean I, I, I go taking chances for other, you know, or <laughs> take chances that affect other people, rather. Um, so whatever they say, isolate for 14 days from that. My contact with them was... Not this past Monday, but the previous. So I'm basically just choosing to isolate and through uh, this upcoming Monday, because why risk it, right? Most likely, I already had COVID in March, though I was never tested. So most likely, I wouldn't have been susceptible to it anyways. Most likely, he got it after he hung out with us. But why risk it? Not for me, obviously, but for other people. Why, why take a risk for someone else, you know, force a risk on someone else. So, I'll be hanging out at home. So, is what it is. At least, you know, I do have all sorts of groceries from um, Costco. Which, of course, that was me going out and hanging out with mom. So, hopefully, I don't have anything to pass along because I would hate for her to get that, but... You know, like I said, most likely fine. Not really concerned, but taking the proper precautions because it's uh, the polite thing to do. So there are a number of productive things that I could have done with my evening. One thing that I could do with my evening that would not be productive would be to see that my buddy David had posted a subclass for 5th edition D&D that he made and decide to go through the books and make a revision pass and send it back to him. That's what I did. And that's exciting for me, because he's he's one of my friends that, that actually took a bit before he started playing 5th edition D&D at all. Because, um, you know, he's not locally that he's in my group. He's out of town. So since I'm not running the game for him, he usually runs the games for his friends there. He just didn't adapt to it as quickly as I did. And he didn't ask for anyone to revise or when I, he was just sort of saying, hey, I made the thing, look at it. To which I came in and said, I changed your thing, here, look at this. So, I mean, I don't know, hopefully he's not offended that I did that. But I did. <laughs> oh well. Would have probably been better to take time in the kitchen and try and like, Reorganize things. I need to get stuff moved around. I want to I wanna put those in a better spot since now that I'm not going to work, I'm working from home, I don't use those nearly as often. So I don't need them like ready to access. And I'd much rather clear this shelf here uh, for my um, the stuff I carry. Uh, I liked having it for that when I first moved in, but I just didn't have room. 
I'd, I'd like to put that stuff there. That way I can keep the counter clear again. That'd be nice. Also, things like a uh, coffee maker and can opener and things like that. I don't, I don't need those on the counter. And I got things like, like I got empty space at the back of these. I'm like, I need to put stuff that I never use and stuff it back there and bring stuff that I do use forward. I'm not getting to any of that tonight. I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna do my best to at the very least figure out something for dinner. And I just ended up making one of the frozen pizzas for dinner. But it's one of them uh, Costco frozen pizzas, so I know it's delicious. And of course, the pizza was delicious as expected. And instead of instead of trying to do anything productive after eating, I went and spent an hour or so on Discord talking with Nick about D and D and my YouTube channels and Dwarven Ford and just whatever. Wasting time. But you know what? I managed to have fun while doing it. And I had fun just sticking around home. I suppose for this weekend that's that's the important part. <laughs> so hopefully I'll be a little more productive uh, tomorrow. Either doing something around here or uh Maybe something from one of my channels. We'll see if we can get done. In order to be able to do that, I'm going to need some rest though, so uh, I'm going to go to bed. Thank you for joining me and joining me as my journey continues.